Hi everyone, meteorologist Matt Scott on this Tuesday. We're happy to report there's a much quieter, much drier scene out there. Got some rain last night. Some of you getting half an inch or three quarters of an inch. Others, not so much. But everyone soaking in lower humidity levels today and into tomorrow. We will build the heat and humidity back in the forecast storms. Back in play before the work week is done. Do they play into the weekend, though? Take a look at a cloud and radar perspective. Nothing doing around here. That's the way we like it. Flow is out of the north and west. Got a little bit of uh, cloud coverage. We'll see that this afternoon. But that's the only issue to the forecast. There's nothing to worry about. Much more comfortable weather for the uh, time being. You can see the, the needles coming out of the north and west. You'll see some clouds in the afternoon. There they are. They will get out of the way in time for tonight. Guess what? Tonight's going to be really nice. With uh, temperatures down to the low 60s, the dew points will still be fairly low. Open up the windows, shut the AC. Clouds back in play tomorrow as we move into uh, get closer to this next front. That's uh, Thursday morning at 11. You see it's still over the Great Lakes, but as it comes this way, Thursday night into Friday, we'll start to see another opportunity of rain. Dew points on hold today. We like that. Tomorrow, same deal. Thursday, not so much. Thursday and Friday, quite humid, but it does break again in time for the weekend. That's good timing, isn't it? You'll see the rain chances spike a little bit for Thursday night into Friday morning. But by Saturday, we're looking good and feeling great. Let's go around the horn. Temperatures into the uh, low to mid 80s. Uh, we should be at 85 for a high. That's about it in New Haven, Brantford. Numbers a little warmer at the shore thanks to that northerly flow. Low 80s in southeastern Connecticut up in a quiet corner. 80 in Killingly, 79 in Pomfret. Low 80s for the capital city, Cromwell, Higginham, New Britain as well. Upper 70s for the Litchfield Hills. Hey, the yard goes have a fairly long homestand. Playing the Portland Sea Dogs tonight, 7.05. Looks good at first pitch, looks good at the last catch for the Yard Goats. Here's a look at a 7 day forecast. If you got tickets for the Yard Goats, most of these days, maybe Thursday night, may have an issue. I don't know if they're playing Thursday night, but I do know that Sunday, we've got a Scooper Sunday benefiting the Jordan Porco Foundation. That'll be fun. All the ice cream you can eat if you buy a ticket. I'll be scooping some. 83 the high today, down to 61 tonight. 88 tomorrow, 89 Thursday, and then milder less humid conditions for the weekend. That is a look at a forecast. Make it a great Tuesday. We'll see you at 4 and 5 o'clock.